Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to Terracho Tamer, which is a turn-based dating sim where you use dice to seduce monsters before they kill you. Rog. Ah! Oh no! A monster! Submit to the wrath of the Scarlet Moon. No, I'll never submit to you. Your blood will be split and sacrificed for the moon goddess. No, not my young, fresh blood. I need that in my body. No, you don't. Oh, uh, yeah, um, yeah, prepare to die, human. Oh, what shall I do? If only I had a strong, brave man woman to save me from being anime by this wild beast. You, uh, huh? Werewolf when it meets a furry. Oh well, I guess I can't do anything about it. What a shame. Now you're just making this weird. Am I? Well, uh, you're not... Uh, whatever. Prepare to die. The Bone Wolf. Choose option, space select, you'll figure the rest out. Block or dodge? Let's see. Well, we'll just do it. You missed. With your big, strong hands. All I can do is seduce. We are very seductive, apparently. <laughs> Maybe... Ouch. Maybe I should start blocking. Or I'm gonna die. So is that a win? I win. What are you doing? Flaunting myself. It's very distracting. That's the idea. Great, I can't focus on killing you. Now I'm hungry and... Oh, God. What a shame. I've got something you can eat. Here, have some bagels. Are you inviting me to? Yes. You're into monsters? Yes. Oh, yeah. All right, I'll bite. Let's do this. Stage one. Well, well, what do we have here? Fresh human flesh. Don't mind if I do. It's definitely in the Bone Wolf versus a succubus. Do you, do you gotta get in on this, Bone Wolf? Like, what do you do in your life? Block? I'm assuming this is gonna be a hard roll. Oh god, Bone Wolf is dying! Dodge. You can do this, Bone Wolf. I have no idea how the dice rolls are figuring into the- oh my god. Okay, that was fatal. Bone Wolf was dead. It's fine. Dodge. And seduce. You got this. Those are looking pretty heavy. Mind if I hold them for you? Those wings, that is. W are you flirting with me? That's my role. You can't do that. Yes, I can. Too bad. You just got out nymphoed. If you're gonna hit on me, at least come up with a better pickup line than that. Nope. Oh god, I have to pick options. She's gone, gone all Shimigami Tensei. 
Your body is 70% water, I'm thirsty. Did it hurt when you fell from heaven? Do you have room for an extra tongue in your mouth? Maybe this one. Ooh, please let me know when you come up with something better. Damn. So we actually got uh, Bone Wolf to survive this time. Alright. 10% water. Extra tongue in your mouth. Alright, that one was pretty good. Thanks, I have a lot of them written down. You know what? Maybe I won't try to devour you. Hmm. You can still do that if you want. Yeah. Oh, well, let's see what's on the menu. By menu, we went to a buffet. It was a very nice buffet, by the way. We did nothing else. Not to him. You will be removed from this world. The void! Oh no, it's come back to haunt me! Hmm, you actually have less HP than uh, Bone Wolf. Maybe you're better at seducing. I'm actually not quite sure how the, that part works. I mean, block and dodge is obvious. Reduce damage or ignore it. In this case, blocking me better. Oh, you heal. Yeah. Damn. You've been succubied. Stop squirming. Make me. Do not resist your fate, mortal. Oh, you're that kind of void. I'm being pretty bad, huh? Go ahead. Anime me. Give your blood and become one with the void. Not sure about blood. But I have other anime I could provide. Please stop making this weird. Okay, sorry about that. Why don't you put those animes to use? Nope. It's probably this one. I think it's just whichever one sounds like it's customized to their species is the correct one, my guess. To what use exactly? Clearly you're not meant for combat. I imagine it'd be better if you brought pleasure to others instead of pain. Can you provide some examples? Well, let me get some DVDs out. Who am I kidding? People don't have DVDs of that stuff anymore. Oh, I can provide some examples, all right. Why don't you come closer? Come closer and watch some wholesome anime with me. Human! Prepare to perish. Your kind is no match for my superior magic. Counterattack and superior attack, huh? Hmm. We're getting we're getting pretty powerful. Oh god, that's the one that's gonna hurt. We can stop it from being a one hit. Okay. Well, you hit both of us. I see. Oh wow! Just blew you over. Human, why are you moving in such a fashion? I'm casting a spell. Now you're mine. What spell is it? I do not recognize those patterns. It's called Hey You. Check out my anime. What? That is a very odd name for a donkey. Wait a minute. You're trying to seduce me. Fool. I will not fall so easily for your seductive tactics. Come already did. If you want to get in my pants, you'll have to show me some knowledge about magic. Question, which of the following is a fire-based spell? This one? That's correct. Knowledge of magic. Now that's something that's sexy. So you're more of a fantasy fan? You make it cast a spell that makes my clothes disappear? We'll see what I have up my sleeve. Damn it. Where the hell did I end up this time? Hey, don't come any closer. Oh, shoot. Seven side die. Wouldn't the multi attack be useless? 
I, we really only fight one target. Mmm, bear block. Okay, let's just do one damage. Dodge again. Yeah. You need to, uh, you know, you don't really need to, like run up with the, do all the gun kata stuff. Yeah, block this. Block. We could have dodged if we had the same roll, but, uh... We win. Are you, uh... Trying to court me? Of course. That robe is nice, but I think I'd look better on you. Oh my, well, I'm flattered. I've never been hit on by being of another race. You seem like you have a lot of DILF energy that needs to be tapped into. Well, I can certainly spoil you if you like. Wait, should I do it with a human? No, I shouldn't. Unless... Alright, I'll leave it up to luck. I'll flip the coin. Heads or tails? Heads. Heads, all right, let's do this. Probably should make it quick, though. I've got a wormhole to catch. Let's see how... He just made a horn pun. Because he has horns. He looks like a vampire or just someone who's really rich? You know, a vampire of the economy. <laughs> I have risen once again. The Scarlet Moon hath arrived, and now it is time to feast. And maybe kill some Belmonts. Health leech. Yeah, we're gonna need to block that. I'm still gonna block. One more, we'll do it. Dodge. Ouch. Seduce. Hey, Mr. Vampire. Aren't you gonna suck my blood? Be dry? Why aren't thou so inclined to have thine blood drained, human? Mayhaps we desire to become a vampire such as myself. You know what I meant. Besides, I'm totally fond of staying as a human. <laughs> Idiot. Humanity is surely flawed. A pile of secrets. I rejected my humanity long ago. And have lived for hundreds of years. Hmm, yeah. I still think humanity's better. Then entertain me, human. Why doth thee believe humanity is superior? Anime? Is the answer anime? Or is it... I don't think it... Well, Garlic Bird might be offensive to the vampire. But well, Garlic Bird is also specific to the character. Um, and the answer is always specific to them. And I think anime would actually scare him away. He'd be like, Anime? Ugh. You are correct. Garlic Bird is truly divine. Oh, how I miss it. Want me to show you something else that makes humans superior? What doth that be? Remove your clothes and I'll show you my little pile of secret. There it is! Very well. Have at thee. Then we play Castlevania. What are you? Cosmos? 
Well, well, well. Who do we have here? If it isn't the one and only Chrysella, the moon goddess. Why do you come before me, human? We're gonna seduce the moon. Are you here to defeat me in combat? To dethrone me? And to wrong Maria's throne for yourself? Hmm? Nah. To stop the annual Scarlet Moon event that terrorizes your people? Nah. To ask for divine favor? Money? Perhaps. Hmm. Well, I cannot grant you any wishes or favors at this time. But out of curiosity, what is it you desire? You. Pardon? I want you, your holiness. I'd like to entangle you, to explore you, to animate you. Oh, that is a rather odd request. But I'll entertain that notion. Impress me and I will reward you accordingly. Double dice. Youch. So, am I going against the total of your dice? So then in this case, I would have to block. Let's see. Oh god, your face just bit me. Which is completely normal. I think we can like constantly block. Because if that's a five, We've got some lucky rolls here, by the way. If that was a 5 total, then that could have been very fatal. So I kind of see... Okay, so... I'm assuming our vampire only heals if we actually attack. Yeah, okay, so it's a total. It's not the... Uh... Block. Ooh, let's be nasty. We try something. Attack. Do you heal? Yeah, you do. So that's actually a good incentive to attack. Mmm, that, that high total. Okay, we don't want to kill you, though. We did buy a little bit of time to get some seduces in. We need to start probably... No, actually. Block here. Yeah. Because if you failed to dodge, we would die. But it was a very high chance to succeed in the guard. Which would essentially be almost worth a dodge. So this is the minimum amount of stuff you do is one. Here is where we have to start dodging. Oh man, almost. Goodbye, vampire. Ha! Hmm, very oppressive, I must say. A perfect body, combined with your charm. Yes, you would be perfect for it. Perfect for what exactly? For hundreds of years, I've brought upon the Scarlet Moon upon this land. The purpose is to give the monsters that dwell in the darkness a chance to rule over humans for once. But there is another reason as well. It's to draw out the perfect vessel, someone who loves monsters as much as I do. And as you stand here before me, I believe you would be perfect for that. You, me, together. We can rule over the humans and monsters alike. What do you say, human? Shall we entangle and become one for eternity? Sure. Wonderful. Let's commence with the ceremony. To be continued? Was that a little to be continued or more like a wink wink? To be continued. Nope. Whatever, I'm out of here. Pausina. 
Incorrect. Do your homework, then return to me. Anime. Useless. Useless. Clearly vampires are superior to humans. No. No? No, I think I'll pass. Why not? Think about it. You can have anything and anyone you want in the palm of your hand. I already have everything I want. But I'm not sure if I can fit in my hand. I don't have the desire for infinite cosmic powers, nor the rule over anybody. I just want to have a good time. That's all. A human. Turning down a goddess's powers. Maybe she was wrong about your kind. So, are uh, we doing this or not? Did you get me all hot and bothered for nothing? Oh, that would be rude to do that. Perhaps we could explore some other options. Huge! Whatever it takes. Show me what you got, baby. Very well. Until the Scarlet Moon sets, I'm all yours. Big! To be continued, if you know what I mean. So that's it for Torato Tamer. Uh, that is all endings. I'm not sure if this is a sequel baiting or anything, or if it's just like a little wink wink to be continued, to kind of like say like, you're not gonna see what's gonna go on off screen. It was also part of a dice game jam, which basically all these games were made with dice mechanics. Um, there was some like more mechanics to this than just the dice. There was like some subtleties to the thing, but they didn't matter too much in the big picture. I know some people might point them out because there is a tendency if I don't mention mechanics or kind of obvious, people think I don't like notice them, but I did. But yeah, this was from the creator of Rose Blight, which is more of a horror story based game. This being just kind of a little cute side thing they made for this dice game jam. And I did like it, actually. It's uh, got a little bit of charm to it. It is kind of cheesy, little one-liners and stuff like that, but it's still got like a, a kind of cute, charming aura to it. If I had to rank the characters of who I would personally go with, probably the Moon Goddess, because the Moon Goddess was huge. Uh, their head was bigger than the size of our entire body, which meant everything else was also scaled up appropriately, which is great. The second one would be, um, second place, would be the, the devil with the uh, the gun and stuff. Because they vaguely reminded me of, um, they were Digimon. Pretty important one, like, Beelzebubmon? Sometimes the American versions had, like, different names. I, I, vaguely, I don't fully remember my Digimon names. But they also reminded me of a character from Trigun, the priest. The one of the main ones, so... Uh, you can tell I've consumed too much media in my lifetime, and I started, like, mixing up names. I don't remember the names. I remember the characters, I just don't remember names. I think they have a character I'm thinking maybe Wolfgang. Something like that. But yeah, that's how I'd rank them. Uh, aside from that, can't really comment too much else. We essentially seduce a bunch of monsters, and that's a good thing. Anyway, so thank you all for watching me play Torato Tamer. I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.